In an effort to popularize science among the UAE's youth, Abu Dhabi is holding the second science festival. After its, its initial success last year that welcomed 100,000 visitors comprised of students, teachers and parents, the fair is delivering a bigger and better experience. Khadija Sali has this reporter. For Amir Ali Tanash and his wife, the education of their children doesn't stop at school. It should be a continuous experience, fun and interactive. He says the Abu Dhabi Science Festival provides the perfect platform that combines learning and play effectively. It's nice show over here. Like kids get uh, get used to these things because in school, you know, it's, they are not practicing this like here. So the these things it sticks in their mind. So in the future. The Science Festival started 25 years ago in Edinburgh with this concept. After more than two decades, the fair is now being held in numerous countries across Europe and other parts of the world. Every year there's something new. And so we try and incorporate some of that if we can. So a, a good example is DNA fingerprinting. When we started 25 years ago, DNA fingerprinting wasn't invented. And now you can buy a DNA fingerprinting kit for under $1,000 and we've got them here. So 25 years ago, no one had done DNA fingerprinting, and now an eight-year-old child can come and do it. The same is true of electronics. We now have little circuits here that children make that have got one-chip microprocessors in them. It's amazing. You know, 25 years ago, the, the home computer was, the, uh, was a great big block and a box, and it really didn't do very much. Now you can put that on a, on a $1 chip. Organizers say the event this year is bigger and better, following the demand they witnessed last year. 800 university students volunteered to become science communicators and were trained for the event to ensure visitors get more information about the exhibits, as well as experience some of them and leave with a better understanding. It's all about instilling a passion for science in our children. And we do that by basically bringing or programming a whole set of really fun activities that are science related. So the kids have a lot of fun, but while they are doing so, they actually learn or discover some very interesting scientific principles. And this is actually a global best practice. It's a global best practice for science popularization. And there are surveys that suggest that it is the link between childhood experiences with informal science learning have a, have a high correlation with ultimate career choice. And so to, to realize this knowledge-based economy on the long run, uh, you need to get more kids to study science and choose that path. Catering to children from 5 to 15 years, its appeal is also to the curious adults. This is my second time I came here. I came last time, last year also. And I find that it's a very nice activity for the, my child to, to have and investigate and see what is the, on the science, how they can do. So I said, why not to bring them here and develop themselves and develop their knowledge to, to understand how the science is, is to, to going to be working. The Abu Dhabi Science Festival will run until the 20th of October at ADMEC and the Abu Dhabi Corniche. Organizers say they expect to exceed last year's visitors since there's already huge demand from residents as well as educational institutions. This is proof that while the whole event may look like fun and games, it is also a step towards achieving the UAE's goal of a knowledge-based economy. Khadija Sali, 7 National News.